Hi, today we are going to tell you about a busy chocolate factory called Valentino's. Sit back, stay focused, and make sure that you don't miss any details. Enjoy! Hi, I'm Fiona. I'm the in-house facility manager at Valentino's, so my job is to keep the factory running. My expertise is in making sure the chocolate production lines are running smoothly. But when it comes to understanding how the electrical system powers the manufacturing lines, well, it's not really my thing, you see. The problem is that when production is interrupted due to an unplanned power outage, I'm the one who's responsible for sorting out this mess. Hey, I'm Carlos. I'm the electrical contractor. A couple of years ago, I visited Fiona's chocolate factory to install and commission her switchboard. Since then though, Fiona seems to have disappeared off the face of the planet. I'm surprised she's not been in touch to discuss regular service checks. I get the impression that Fiona only sets foot inside her electrical room when something's not working. I can't say for sure, but I very much doubt that her switchboard is being well maintained. Hi, I am Peter, the switchboard builder. I'm the guy who built Fiona switchboard. To be honest, no one's more familiar with the switchboard than me. The point is, once Fiona's one year warranty expires, the switchboard is no longer my responsibility. That means, after that, I have no more visibility on its conditions and I cannot know if it is working properly according to the original specifications. Well, had Fiona, Carlos and Peter taken advantage of Ecostructure Facility Expert digital logbook from day one, the whole process of a switchboard installation and maintenance could have been flawless at Valentino's. Once I'm done manufacturing Fiona's switchboard, I use the Ecostructure Power Commissioning tool to connect to the switchboard. Then I can add all the devices either through Ethernet cable or by scanning their QR code. I test the devices to make sure they communicate well with each other. I configure the protection settings based on the design specification. I run the factory acceptance test. The report is generated automatically. Now comes the most beautiful part of the story. I generate the unique QR code. This QR code becomes the unique ID card for this switchboard and it can carry all the relevant switchboard data. I can then upload all additional project documentation into the commissioning tool, including manuals, drawings, single line diagrams, and the list of spare parts. These documents are now securely stored within the Schneider Electric Cloud database. The project history report is automatically saved. All set! I'm ready to hand over the project to Carlos. Now, I'm going to export the data to Ecostructure Facility Expert. It is a powerful app designed for equipment maintenance management, and I'm gonna use it to facilitate my project handover. In a few seconds, I receive on my own Facility Expert account everything that I have created previously on Ecostructure Power Commission. Now let's do something very meaningful. Set up the preventive maintenance reminder. The setup is really easy because the maintenance instructions have been loaded automatically. All I need to do is to plan maintenance schedule by setting up reminders in my calendar as frequently as recommended by the manufacturer. It's a pleasure to use. I add Carlos in facility expert so he can have access to our secure database for his upcoming commissioning work. So now we are all able to share the same information. I know that Carlos will never remember to change the default password of Masterpacked MTZ unless being reminded. So I create a note to remind him to change the default password after he finishes the final settings.
This makes sharing and collaboration so much easier. Peter just sent me an invitation to access the project on Facility Expert. Now, when I open the app, it takes me straight to Peter's project folder. As soon as I've commissioned Fiona's switchboard and finished a couple of final settings, I change the default masterpacked MTZ password following Peter's instructions. Next, I upload my final commissioning report, which is generated as part of the handover documentation for Fiona. What's great is that there's no longer any need to print out any paper documentation because all documents can be accessed with the QR code. As soon as I've finalized the deal with Peter, I send him a request asking him to make me the designated owner of the shared project folder. And yes, of course, I accept Carlos' request. At the same time, I can keep my access rights for the project folder set as collaborator status. In a nutshell, Carlos did an amazing job installing the electrical distribution system at Valentino's. During the final handover, I was so relieved that he didn't send me all the usual pile of paper documents, which I tend to lose. This time, Carlos explained to me that I just have to flash the QR code on my switchboard to bring up all the digital documentation on Facility Expert. What I really love is that not only is all my documentation in digital format, but now I get a notification message 30 days before maintenance tasks are scheduled. This gives me more than enough time to schedule a proper maintenance window and to make sure that our production lines run smoothly with no nasty surprises. So there you are. Peter and Carlos are now both project collaborators in Facility Expert. And just like Fiona at Valentino's Chocolate Factory, they are also notified 30 days in advance of scheduled maintenance. This next notification relates to Masterpack MTZ and Open Switchboard Advanced Maintenance. Over time, a dozens of so specific checkups will be required. For example, dusting the entire switchboard, checking the torque of power connections, greasing the plugs, and testing of circuit breaker protection functions. As soon as I receive these notification alerts, I contact Carlos and I agree with him that I will offer the required services this time because everything is in my domain of expertise. Then I get in touch with Fiona to schedule a service appointment. And I really love this way of working because now I have direct contact with Fiona, which will help me to develop ongoing business with her, not just in terms of supplying her with new switchboards, but also with long-term maintenance and potentially other high-value services like troubleshooting, renovation, and energy management. Digital Logbook is a collaborative tool that efficiently manages documentations from all different collaborators. So now you can say goodbye to out-of-date files, conflicting information, and unclear roles and responsibilities. According to the IEEE 493 standard, a poorly maintained switchboard is 62% more likely to fail compared to a well-maintained switchboard. The preventive maintenance reminder in the digital logbook simplifies the scheduling and tracking of critical asset maintenance needs. So now Valentino's Chocolate Factory can minimize the risk of downtime and fires and maximize the operational life of this valuable electrical installation. Peter and Carlos are Schneider Electric partners. They are digitally empowered to provide value-added services from preventive maintenance to equipment upgrade and replacement to real-time monitoring and troubleshooting ecostructure power services. And now, they are enjoying sustainable revenues throughout the entire life cycle of the customer's electrical installations. <laughs>